She's the mom at the center of a headline-making murder case. Lori Shaver's husband, Michael, vanished in 2015. She said he left her and their kids to start a new life. Ann Mercogliano spoke to their neighbor, Kurt Rule. He went missing. Tell us about that. We just assumed that, okay, they had a big fight. It got to the point of too far, and, and he decided not to come back. Lori Shaver remarried a year later, with the ceremony taking place in the backyard of her house outside Orlando. But a suspicious friend of the missing first husband raised an alarm with cops. In the backyard of Lori Shaver's home, cops saw this, a fire pit that to them looked to be discolored and in the shape of a body. They dug it up, and there they found Michael Shaver's remains under the concrete. Yes, the body was buried in the same backyard where Lori Shaver was remarried. Right past where she's starting her walk down the aisle, you can actually see the fire pit in that video. Lori Shaver was charged with murder. She released this video. I am not guilty. I had nothing to do with the murder of Michael Shaver. At the trial, a bombshell. Lori Shaver's daughter, who was just seven at the time of her dad's disappearance, took the stand and testified that it was she who shot her father because he was being physically violent with her mom. The judge ordered cameras not to show her face. I shot him in the back of the head. I don't know where the bullet went, but that's where I was aiming. That's where I'm pretty sure it hit. Was this a daughter telling the truth? Or was she trying to take the rap to save her mother from a life term in prison? The jury deliberated for four hours. The defendant is guilty of second degree murder. We spoke to Michael Shaver's sister, Stacy Turner. I have mixed feelings about Lori's daughter testifying. I believe that Lori is a narcissist, so she was trying to find somebody to blame it on. And unfortunately, that person was her daughter. I think Lori is a very evil person. Lori Shaver will be sentenced November 25th. Her daughter was never charged.